Hey there, guys. It's Buddy Simna. Oops. I don't want to. No. <laughs> Oops, sorry, I did not have me to that. Hello, guys. It's Buddy Simna2 here, and welcome back. Today, we are here with Skyrim. And it has been roughly three months August, September, October, November. Yeah, it has been three months since my last Skyrim episode was released. So, anyway, we. In the last episode, we raided the Thalmor. Got some bits and pieces out. I forgot to save a few prisoners, but anyway, we need to fast track and go have a look at the blades, I believe they're called. It's a bit tricky to remember how to use all the controllers and that because a bit issues, so yeah, everything's a bit back to front, all the controller buttons and that there, but no worries. Sound it's oops, no, I do not want to how do I run again? There's got to be a way to run. Oh, I killed a damn chicken, really? <sighs> I can't remember my button controls. I think I might just go ahead and fix those up and I'll be with you guys at the moment. Okay, so we're back in River Run again. I think I've sorted out all the controls, as long as I don't kill chickens. I can't believe they want us to try and kill me and put a bouncy on my head just for just killing a chicken. Like, really? Okay, let's open up the sleeping giant and then go see the bleeds. And yes, it's been quite some time since the last episode. I'm, and it doesn't worry me, really, because none of you guys watched these episodes. I don't think I've really had a single view on these anyway. Okay, let's talk to Daphne. Yes, You're of course. You're safe in my room, as promised. Did you learn anything useful? The Thalmor know nothing about the dragons. Really? That seems hard to believe. You're sure about that? Why'd you send me in if you if you weren't wrong, going to believe me? Yes, I'm sure. They're looking for a name called Esborn. Esborn? He's alive? I thought the Thalmor must have got him years ago. That crazy old man. Figures the Thalmor would be on his trail, though, if they were trying to find out what's... You mean aside from wanting to kill every blade they can lay their hands on? Esbern was one of the blade's archivists, back before the Thalmor smashed up during the Great War. He knew everything about the ancient dragon lore of the blades. Obsessed with it, really. Nobody paid much attention back then. I guess he wasn't as crazy as we all thought. They seem to think he's hiding in Rift. So the Thalmor think the blades know about the dragons. Ironic, right? The old enemies assume that every calamity must be a plot by the other side. Even so, we've got to find Esbern before they do. He'll know how to stop the dragon. Do they know where he is? Riften, eh? Probably down in the Rattler, then. You'd better get to Riften. Talk to Brynjolf. He's well-connected. A good starting point, at least. Oh, and when you find Esbern, if you think I'm paranoid, you may have some trouble getting him to trust you. Just ask him where he was on the 30th of Frostfall. He'll know what it means. 30th of Frostfall, that's lovely. What happened to the blades? Why are you on the run? The Thalmor happened. They've been hunting down every blade they can find for the past 30 years. Thanks to the White Gold Concordat, they've been able to operate throughout the Empire with impunity. What's that? The Great War. Only 30 years passed and already ancient history to most people. Seems to me like it just ended. It's never really ended for me. But to answer your question, the White Gold Concordat was the fancy name they put on the peace treaty between the Empire and the Thalmor. It ended the war and saved the Empire to fight another day. Also trampled on the sacred name of Talos and gave the Thalmor free reign to stamp out Talos worship throughout the Empire. Hmm, there's no simple answer to that. You want the long version or the short version? Give me the long version. They're the rulers of the Aldmeri Dominion, what used to be the imperial provinces of Somerset Isle and Valenwood. The Thalmor take the arrogance of high elves to the extreme. They believe they are the rightful rulers of all of Tamriel. For a century or more, the Thalmor had been picking away at the Empire. 
Valenwood was the first, then the province of elsewhere. But even the Blades didn't see the Great War coming. We underestimated the Thalmor, and they destroyed us. Hi, Lilia. Yeah, let's get all my stuff. Oh, okay. That ended a bit quicker than I thought. Do I have enough room? That's always the question on this game. Not really. I suppose we could dump half of the stuff. What oh, easy suit anyway. Let's go. Let's make our way to Rifton, the lovely town that I actually really just don't like. Oops, wrong button again. Rifton is the town in Skyrim, which I just, yeah, I don't like at all. So let's just go to the map, and which way is Rifton? Can I try and fast travel to it? Not really. Is there any other quests I can do right now in the name of find the Regan Gale? I suppose we should return the claw. That's probably the main thing. Let's go in here. Let's return the claw. Here we go, and let's return the claw. And then, Show those thieves not to steal from Luke and Valeria. And then, as soon as we give the claw back, we should have access to all his stuff. The sooner you find the claw, I have your claw, you not quite up. <laughs> yes, there I do, of course. Strange. It seems smaller than I remember. <laughs> Funny thing, I'm gonna put this back where it belongs. I'll, I'll never forget this. Right on your counter. Great thing for me and my sister. Thank you. Thank you so much for taking care of those thieves. What have you got for oh, this? And a bit of that. Now I prefer everything that I can never have enough of is lockpicks. So let's buy a lockpick. And do I have anything which I always acu always accumulate? Just endless junk in this game. <laughs> a platter. Like, why do I need a platter for? Let's sell that. Wooden plate. No value to it. But maybe we'll get rid of it. It just adds up to weight. Anything else I can get rid of? Nothing, really. Thank you, Lucan. Till next time. And this is what I enjoy about him. You can just go ahead and just take. You and me, we're the only people around who aren't complete fools. Yeah, but I get to is everything you need in a general store. take minor. Anything else I can take? Steal from chest? No, I don't want to steal from chest. Okay, thank you very much. See you guys next time. This family's always so nice. They give you free gold all the time. I've always wondered what happens, because I know you can marry people in this game. What happens if you're a woman? Can you marry people here as well as a guy? Don't know. I've always played as a guy in this game. Sorry, wrong buttons again. Anyway, let's try and figure out in a need return to whatever that is find the source of power at SharePoint speak with the leader of the Camunians join the Imperial Legion well, let's just go ahead and join the Imperials that shouldn't be too hard to do because I think the Imperials I might just stick with those guys here I think the Thalmor seem to be more of a Nazi sort of group, really. Oh, I'm always going to use the wrong ones. It's going to take me like such a long time to remember to push the different buttons. And in solitude, the best place, because I prefer to use iron arrows in this game, because I'm pretty good, is just stand here. Just go sit AFK here and just collect all the arrows constantly because I just keep firing them and you get an unlimited amount of arrows. Good trick. Anyway, 
way as usual we come up here and I was thinking I'm pretty sure I'm dark elf aren't I I'm some form of alpha can't remember what I am if you need potions head over to Angeline's aromatics I'm telling you Ulfric's planning an attack on white run he'd be insane to try he doesn't have the men that's not what my scouts report sir every day more join his cause Riften, Dawnstar, and Winterhold support him. It's not a cause. It's a rebuild. Now let's just take a picture it, of their map here. Going to try to take White Run. Have no idea if that actually no, worked. Not even sure how to take. Right to troops in his city. Oi, no, stop hand, pushing me over. To oh, okay, let's just talk to you. Men now giving free reign to anyone who wanders into the castle? Yep, they are. Do you have some reason to be here, citizen? I believe we've already met. Have we? Oh, oh, of course. You were at Helgen. One of the prisoners, if I recall correctly. Yep. I helped Hadvar escape. He said he would vouch for me. I was set free. I could have gone anywhere. I came here to fight for the Empire. Hadvar's alive. I hope that's true. He's a damn good soldier. But he hasn't reported in yet, so he can't exactly confirm your story. In the meantime, why don't you have a chat with Lady Rifta? I suspect we might have use for someone resourceful like you. Not many survived, Helgen. Besides, I'm sure your being imprisoned was all a terrible misunderstanding. Of course so, it was. if he wants to stand outside the protection of the Empire, fine. Let Ulfric pillage his city. General. You people and your damn Jarls. Sir, you can't force a Nord to accept help he hasn't asked for. If Ulfric's making a move for... You survived Helgen? General Tully has told me what Draft happened. Not many made it out alive. This time I've got a good feeling about you. Thank and you. I don't often get good feelings about anything. A warrior knows to trust her gut. Like I'm not going to go through the normal process with you. I've got a little test lined up. Pass that, and we'll talk about you joining the Legion. Okay, let's go. What kind of test? The kind that evaluates your usefulness during... Duress. I'm sending you to clear out Fort Haragstaff. If you survive, you'll pass. If you die, then I'll have no... The ancients built many of the fortresses that dot the landscape of Skyrim. Sadly, most have fallen into... Fort Haragstad is one of the few that remains mostly intact. We're going to install a garrison there, but first, you're going to clean out the bandits that have moved in. Consider the forty yours. Good, that's what I want to hear. <laughs> now go make it happen, soldier. Yes, sir. With the game, you always get weird. <sighs> you always get weird glitches where people do not talk, which is always a bit weird. High elves. What could it mean? Return of the Dragonborn, and who among us could possibly hold that honor? What is it, Elric? Huh. You wear that armor well. Iron may be simple, but it'll stop enough to keep you in the fight. Okay, let's go ahead and let's do... Oh, up here, really? What's this little place? This is probably going to end bad. Speed running to the downward embassy. Let's just back away slowly. Oh, that's one thing I hate. Is the high honesty like I have no idea like does anyone else if you watch if you even watch these videos just travel like me just jump down and just randomly run about that's all I simply do is just run about and that is it I never follow tracks. I never follow paths. What is this house up here?
basta aqui. Okay, we destroyed the bandit chief, that's pretty good. An iron shield. Let's take that off of her. Let's take all that gold off of her. And those are pretty good, but they're pretty... How's that heavy armor? Let's take that off you, let's take that off you. Let's take that off you. And let's go to me. And it's one thing I always do, I always try and... Um, swap around my utensils, blue robes, drop that, let's drop that, and always try and swap around everything I have, so that there's, doesn't look the best one, so you drop those ones there, and get rid of anything else that you do not need, like party clothes, you don't want to wear all that type of stuff, and this all adds up weight. So let's equip that one there. Oops. Let's equip. Drop that one there. And now we drop those ones there, which I have to try and figure out. Always love this game where you just scroll around this. Oh, that's not me. And you just get everything you need. Get that there, there, small ground to your peel, and you take over their boots. So, you add those ones there, and drop them off. Nice and boring. And for some reason, my vision's not going that well. So, an old abandoned looking house here. I don't see how people survive in this world, it'd just be so cold. Baked potato, why not? A beggar. Let's read the deal. Free gold. And gold. You can never have enough gold in this game. Anyway, let's continue with our quest to wherever I'm go going. There's got to be an easier way to get up here. <laughs> Sorry about all this weird random stuff going on here. Surely they've got a passageway. Okay, let's just find the road and I'll be back with you guys. Well, I'm not going to be back with you guys. We need to just continue trying to find out how to get there. Okay, so it looks like there's a road that goes down and around here. That's, that's the downside with this game. <laughs> it takes forever to get to places. Especially when you first start out before you can get your waypoints, you just easily jump around the map.
my waypoint just disappeared. That's a little bit odd. So it's here. Okay, I've discovered this here, and now let's go save. New save. Hello. And yes, let your workers do all the jobs for you. And then what you do is just slowly... Wrong button again. Oops. At least I'm blowing her down. Where are you? You're not loading in for me. Oh, shoot. That's a quick kill, thanks Sylvia. And as you can tell, I'm very uh, thrilled about this. And just const just constantly pretty much just run, that's what you should do. Run, run as fast as you can. You can't catch me because I'm going to burn you to death. Thank you. And do you have some arrows for me? No, you do not. Where's your other friend? Should be just over here. How do I get to this place over here? Oh! Where? Okay, now let's just quickly swap to the bow again. Ah, oh, wrong button! Oh, beautiful kill shot. I love the little slow mos they do as well. It's always pretty good. Whatever you call them. Looks like there's everyone out here. And let's go into Fort Huggenstein. Burn, baby, burn. Oh, shoot. <laughs> There's a good amount of damage done to me. Let's just eat all these greens here. Eat these cheese wedges. Eat that wheel. Eat it there and eat a few apples here. And you are now dead. And let's actually save this here in case any more bad guys come running in. And I am a wood elf, that's what I am. Let's be pause the game right here. And then let's get back. Oh, are you okay, Lydia? You're all good? Heart's pounding a little bit here. Feels like I'm about to drop dead. Anyway, let's go up around here. And hope there's no one hiding in here. That's good. Anything else up here?
I love trying to pick locks. I can never have the ability to do it. I always snap them. Like I'll go through. Like I'll be so determined to get into this lock. There's nothing in there. And I'll just literally just. I'll literally just spend all my pickaxes or pickaxes locks. And surely everyone's exactly the same. They'll just keep using up all their picks. That dresser is empty, no point looking at that there. Archery, lovely. And I know I shouldn't really be reading all those books, I should be storing them for later on, but I've no place. You need gold, orcish, dagger. You have to raid places, otherwise it's doing things. I'm pretty sure when we see this lady again, she thinks we're going to just be dead, that we'll never return, but we surprise her with survival of the fittest. And I am the fittest because I have the command to respawn myself if I die. Which happens quite a lot. That is wrong button again. Anything of value around here does not look like it at all. So let's go ahead and let's fast travel to let her know that we've emptied out this area. Oh, what? There's another door? Didn't I just go through that door? No, oh, prison. Okay, did not know there's a prison. Oh, hello. Thank you, Lydia. You're really good. Let's take all that there. Is there anything else you guys have here? Take the coin purse. Oh, what happened? <laughs> that was an easy kill, wasn't it, Lydia? You just stabbed and shot you. Lovely food. And uh, anything in your chest here? Oh, beautiful. Fifty bucks, may as well take that there. Hey Lydia. Anyone stuck in these cells down here? Doesn't look like it, that's pretty good. This net style fast track back. Oh, I'll have to get out of this building first. Just let me fast track it to the building. And I need to change over these controls because honestly, just buggy me. Like, fire, that should be run. Like, that's all back to front. And I thought I'd fix it. Okay, let me fast travel. Yes, I don't want to. World map is X. And yes, I am currently looking at a Xbox controller on what buttons to press. Very smart, because for some reason Xbox controller does not want to work through here. And that's, <laughs> and that's mainly because it's a USB game play. So it's not a genuine Xbox controller, which is a little bit sad, but I don't own one of those. So let's go surprise her that we are alive. Uh, 
the Tell me again why I'm wasting men chasing after a fairy tale. Welcome back, soldier. I'm glad you made it in one piece. I'll send men to garrison the fort right away. Thank you. you. Well. I'm impressed. But before we go any further, it's time for you to officially join the Legion. Oh, thank Speak you. Speak with General Tullius. He'll administer the oath. Got a leg problem, man? the Legion, you'll be taking an oath binding you to the service of the Emperor and thus to every citizen of the Empire. Are you prepared to make that commitment? Action, not sure. I need to think about it. Oh, yes, of course, I'm well, sure. Then, repeat after me. Upon my honor, I do swear undying loyalty to the Emperor, Titus Mead II. Upon my honor, I do swear undying loyalty to the Emperor, Titus Mead II. And unwavering obedience to the officers of his great empire. And unwavering obedience to the officers of his great empire. May those above judge me, and those below take me, if I fail in my duty. May those above judge me, and those below take me, if I fail my Long duty. Long live the Emperor. Long live the Empire. Long live the Empire. Long live the Empire. Welcome to the Imperial Thank Legion, you. soldier. Just remember, we take care of our own. Speak to Baron. Now, if I'm not mistaken, Legate Ricca has a special assignment for you. Tell me again why I'm wasting men chasing after a fairy. Welcome to the Legion of... If Ulfric gets his hand on that crown, it won't be a fairy tale. It'll be a problem. Don't Welcome to the Legion, Auxiliary. Listen up. Ulfric's right-hand man, Galmar Stonefist, has located what he believes is the final resting place of the Jagged Crown. We're going to make sure he doesn't get his hands on it. The rest of my men are already assembling outside Corvinjun. I'll meet you there as soon as I finish up here. Okay, thank you. Get to Corvin June as soon as you're ready. I'll meet you there. Not everyone's agreed to the move. And we'll go there and we shall meet her. But I believe we will meet her. Thinking Skiver's got warm beds and cold mead. You look like you could use both. Thank you. But as you guys can see here, this is the way that you get free iron arrows. Is here in solitude. You wait here and you take the arrows. And you just keep standing there and keep taking arrows. Because iron arrows are the best form of damage, and well, to me, they do anyway. Just keep here standing, clicking the arrows, and that is what I'm going to do for quite some time. Thank you guys for watching. And well, I'll see you guys in the next episode when we go to find the lovely Jagged Crown. I've run out of time for today, and that's where we're going to end it off, is joining the lovely Imperial Army. Thanks you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Cue that Skyrim outro, I suppose. Okay, goodbye. Cheerio!